Welcome back to another BCHL report brought to you by Ultimate Hockey and Skate here on Shot TV, joined by V's forward Scott Conway. Behind me is a plaque revealing the 50 goal scorers and 100 point guys in BCHL history for the Penticton V's. And Mr. Conway's name's going to go on here very quickly. Uh, Scott, uh, recently you hit the 50 goal plateau. You're closer now to 60, but let's just talk about that feat. Uh, what's that mean to you to get that marker? Uh, obviously a special. Not many people can get uh, 50 goals or 100 uh, points for that matter. But uh, yeah, it was nice to get the 50 and 100 on the same point. And uh, I mean, at the end of the day, we still got games left and uh, we we're looking forward to playoffs. So, Right in the middle of the road trip, you did it. Uh, empty netter, shorthanded, in fact, to cap off a comeback in Victoria. One point, you were down 5-2 in that game. When you had that puck behind the net, did the eyes light up when you saw an empty net staring you down and a chance to hit 5-0? Well, our goalie, Zach Driscoll, made a nice play, and then I just found a lane uh, through the middle of the ice, and I saw their goalie like pretty much on their bench, and and uh, I was like, why not, right? So um, things weren't going well that game for me, and uh, I mean, I turned it around at the end there. So, what about before this season? Now you're going to be a guy coming in, counted on for scoring. Was 50 in the front of the mind, or is it something kind of you thought about but weren't focusing on overly? I had my goals, and that was definitely one of them. Um, I still haven't reached my other one yet, so. Uh, maybe just keep keep passing the puck and uh, hopefully get to at least 120. So, a lot of players of some pretty special ilk have got 50. Ray Ferraro, Brett Hall on this board, Joe Murphy, uh, guys like Bo Bennett have reached 100 points as well. Have you ever thought about that kind of echelon of player that you have joined uh, in this franchise's history? Is that something you reflect once the season's over? Yeah, I still don't think it's set in. <laughs> Obviously, there's some big names on this board here, but uh, I, I haven't looked at it really uh, fully yet, and uh, I will at the end of the year after uh, we bring home the big trophy, hopefully. So, You've been so consistent all season long, obviously, over a point per game guy, over two points per game guy. When did you start thinking, you said earlier, year, my goal is 50, one of them, but when did you start thinking that was going to be attainable? Did you notice you're on a roll at some point in the season? Uh, I didn't. Um, I, uh, my dad was saying, you're at 50 goals now. And uh, I, I just looked back and I'm like, wow, I, I didn't seem like that many goals had, uh, had gone in. But, I mean, I found ways, and that's all that matters at the end of the day. You just find ways to, to get the puck in the net and find the guys back door for uh, tap-in. So. Now you're closer to another milestone is 6-0. We see names up here as well, and one name you could match is a year you're born. Is that something that's the next goal before the season's out with about five games left is getting the 60? Uh, yeah, we'll see what we can do. Um, there's, uh, like you said, five Five games left, so uh, as long as I keep putting the puck in the net, we never know where I'll end up on this board. So, uh, like I said, at the end of the day, all that matters is uh, win, win the trophies, RBC, and then obviously the league and stuff like that. So, 100 points already and more, over 50 goals, rewriting the history book. Scott Conway of your Penticton Bees. This has been another BCHL report brought to you by Ultimate Hockey and Skate. I'm Fraser Rogers.